All right, hello everybody. Welcome to this small tutorial, which I never do on this channel. All right, let's cut the cheese and get right to it. You know when you want to do Lightroom proofing, right? When you have a client or a someone you took a picture of, and you and you want to, you took a hundred photos, and you want them to be able to pick ten photos so that you can edit them. Well, there's a really easy way to do that, and it's called Lightroom proofing. Now, uh, it can be hard to figure out because you can't do it within Lightroom itself or at least I can't what you have to do is go to lightroom.adobe.com okay but first before you do that you bring in your photos to Lightroom create a collection and if you don't know how to do that you go down to this collections pane right click and hit create collection you can make a collection set uh, you can go ahead and figure out what all that is uh, but let's say we created this collection called wasteland shoot so we have all these photos in here right and uh, let's go back to this one. I like this one. We'll come up to here in the library setting. Okay, I think. <laughs> we'll go to sync with Lightroom. Okay, we'll start the sync. And if it's not syncing for you, you got to figure out why. But let's just say everything is going smooth and it starts to sync. Then you go over to your internet source and you go to www.lightroom.adobe.com. And uh, oh, it didn't work. There's no no www dot. Okay, Lightroom .adobe .com. Drag it down here so you have it saved. Then you'll find all your stuff. In here under albums, you'll find the Wasteland shoot, which is the collection we made. It's syncing to Lightroom. Then you can come down to here and click proofing. Once you click proofing, you can hit enable collaborative proofing. Down here, it'll say proof. And then you can hit this, which copies the link. And then you can hit limit selection to say 10 photos. I want my client to pick 10 photos. You'll copy this link. You'll send them the link. Let's just say I'm that person. I'll hit. I'll put the link in my uh, my internet source, my browser. And this is the photos. Now they can click on the photo and they can pick the photo down here. I can't do it because I'm the author. And then they can make comments and go, Hey, this this photo is really cool, but I don't like this. So I want you to do this or whatever. And they'll make the comments. And then later, when you go back to proofing, and they've picked their 10, they'll show up in here. God, I was pointing to the screen with my finger. I'm an idiot. But you'll see the photos in here. And then down under here, uh, it'll say Create New. And you can create a new album. You can title the album, say, Wasteland Finals. And then once you do that, uh, you go back to Lightroom. And all of the finals, well, you'll have a new album in here called Wasteland Finals. And then uh, it's, it's really easy. You'll have those 10 photos ready to go just like that it's really easy process I love it uh, I just figured it out so anywho that is my underprepared novice tutorial so thank you for watching and until further news I shall talk to you later